I'm trying to move it up because we have seven minutes now and I'm ready. <laughs> Seven minutes matters. I care about a couple things. Seven I minutes. Care about yes, Rog. We're hacking for and seven that's what minutes. We're gonna talk about. Potentially, it was a text he sent. Let's just just hit him up and say Gary's just looking to get together with you. That's what it was. Gonna... Yeah, we're just trying to jam together. Next week. Yep. Still important, right? Yep. Okay. Um, those four are coming into town tomorrow morning. Dude. Yeah, he's trying to get them to, the four of them to come through on the city tomorrow. That's fucking nuts. The Yes. You said you may go, it's in the middle of a can. Yes, if they can fly me in really, really, really yeah. efficiently, yeah. I would consider leaving can for like six hours. Something quick for Team Gary V, I'm yeah. sorry. Yeah. Go. What up Team Gary V followers? Number one, I see some of you following Team Gary V more than me. It hurts my fucking feelings. Thank you, Welcome. Already what we're doing is gonna be Overvalued that like, like we might just be over like more than is what we were. And he's okay with that. And he just wants to talk. Talk, about, talk it. about it. Understood. Next Thursday evening, uh, you and you were gonna do drinks for an hour, so we need to move out either for the hour with. Um, yeah. Hi, I know about the Dallas event in London. Like you just want to be cognizant of your scheduling. October fourth. Yeah. Yeah. If Dublin's the next week, are we moving forward east? Alex. Yeah. Uh, you're, you, Alex. Uh, Alex R. So you just go back to Dublin. Gotcha. I'm gangster like that. I know you are. Dude. All these Pittsburgh. <laughs> how many, there's like a million of them, right? There's like a lot. I mean, how many people are fucking involved with high school football in Pittsburgh? Uh, can you just put them in a folder? Gary, these bags, Lev. the guy who did the bags. Yes. Uh, you promised him an Instagram shout out. I did? Yeah. Mm -hmm. on, a, on like an Instagram story? Yeah. Cool. Yo, Connor, thank you so much for hooking up all my guests with the bags every time. I appreciate it. Want to give you some love because you fucking deserve it. Cool. Thank you, Gary. You're welcome. It's done. It's in there. Do you think they, uh, Set up real fast for a mashup around audit your inner circle. Around what? Audit your inner circle. Yeah. Yo, what up, guys? Uh, one theme that I really fucking people are like, yo, how do I build my self awareness? How do I build my optimism? How do I change my mindset? It's the people around you. If your best friend is Debbie Downer, you're not gonna be as optimistic as you can be. If the people that from your town that you hang out with have no fucking ambition, you're going absolutely nowhere. If you listen to your dad every day about how the government sucks, you're not gonna love life. You've got to audit your inner circle. Podcast friends, listen to me. Listen very carefully to this mashup and these thoughts because this underlining tone of who you surround yourself with absolutely fundamentally changes who you are. Period, end of story. When I hung out with Silicon Valley in 2005 to 2010, I was a different dude. When I hang out in the agency land right now, I'm a different dude. When, I'm, like, it, when I was in college at Mount Ida, different dude, like you're a different person. And I'm telling you right now, this morning podcast, or this podcast, because I know some of you listen to it at late, this podcast, if I can get one of you, one person listening to this, to dump one loser person in their circle and add one, whoever's that smiley, happy as fuck person at work that you don't talk to that much, that's at a cubicle around the way, or that awesome, like that, fr you don't know how everybody has, like you have a friend, but their friend like went to college with them, you don't really know them, but like the three times you see them a year, they're positive as shit, and like they're fucking doing things, surround yourself with those people. Seek out your friend's friend who brings positive vibes and make them part of your world and cut out your homie from college that thinks the world sucks. Watch what that addition and subtraction does to your life. It's gonna be sloppy though. <laughs> yeah, I got you. <laughs> Twitter, one month away from the NFL draft. Actually, the end of this month. Headed to Dallas, 
Gonna be in the green room with my boy Josh Jackson, first round picks, baby. Looking for some brands, businesses that want to biz dev in the Dallas market around the NFL draft. Looking to do something gnarly with Vader Sports. Get at me, form below. Hit me up. All right, let's go.